Right, I'm joined of Ollie Arblast after Port Vale's 1-1 draw here at the Abbey Stadium. And Ollie, as a player's perspective, talk us through how that game went. Uh, no, nah, I think we dominated first half. I thought we were on top with large spells of the game, but I think when we're on top like that first half, I think we've got to be more ruthless. Um, but yeah, a lot of positives in that game for us and a uh, tough place to come, so we'll take the point. Had the chance right at the end to score. Um, of course, it was deflected, but imagine if that had gone in. What was the celebration going to be if that had gone in? I don't know. I just think that had I got, had I gone over the top and uh, I'd have probably jumped in the away end. <laughs> Tuesday night we take on Sutton and now I know a lot of uh, Vale players, sorry Vale fans want to win this because you get United, yeah, Liverpool's in the fourth round so how are we looking towards that? Yeah no obviously we've not really focused on that because obviously we've been trying to focus on this game but we've got a chance to reach the fourth round so I know we'll be back in and we'll be preparing for that game like we do every game but yeah it's exciting. And I know you've got to look at the positives from this game, but last minute penalty save, you know, it's not all doom and gloom, um, a very informed Cambridge side, so we've got a lot of positives to take from that. Yeah, no, we take the point, uh, like I say, Connor's done amazing at the end and uh, managed to save the penalty, but yeah, definitely a tough place to come and definitely take the point. Right, so FIFA 24, well, yeah, EAFC 24 has just come out, I saw on your story that you were playing it, um, so UFC uh, 24 rating has just come out and you've got to be fuming with that surely, Yeah. you've got to be fuming. Yeah. Right. I know Conor, Rip Conor Ripley highest, highest rated in the club but when he's making pen saves like that I'll, uh, we'll let him off but yeah 59 it's a bit I've, I've got an upgrade though plus 6 from my first season on FIFA so hopefully keep keep going up and up we've got the stats here what, what are you changing from them stats there Um. <laughs> Physicality 66 is my highest start. I don't. I'm not sure that's my my game, but I'd probably my passing should be maybe a little bit higher, and um, my shooting's probably too high. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers, Ollie. No worries. Right, we're outside the Abbey Stadium now. We're joined with Con Ripley, the man of the moment. 90th minute penalty save. Talk us through it. Uh, yeah, just one of those things again. Another penalty save and. Uh, just happy with it, really happy to get the point. And I've got to say, yet again, I predicted it, so maybe I'm your good luck charm for penalties. I think you are, mate. You may. Have you predicted it again? Well, we'll see. Did you predict the other five that I saved in the last season? You know what? <laughs> no, 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 no. Right, I, the crew one, I predicted that they would miss all of them. Right, I, no, honestly, like, I didn't get it on video, but I, I, hand on heart, I predicted that they'd miss all of him. But, um, no, obviously, to concede a goal, you, you're not obviously as happy as what you could be. But on a team performance, and especially a uh, defensive display, it's a, ve it's a very positive uh, game. Yeah, listen, the I think defensively, de defensively we are sound. Um, it was just one of those things that he just got at the back post and he, and he headed it in. It was frustrating because you know we were in control and then we let them back in so that's a disappointment for us but um, on the flip side we've gone away to a team that's won three on the bounce at home and we've we've took it all the way and we we've come out with a point and I think we're fourth now so we're still you know staying at the top of the table and, and that's where we want to be. And uh, the man that created the chance, Okanajiri, if I can pronounce his name right, were you warned about him at the start? Because I know a lot of Cambridge fans are absolutely worshipping the ground that he walks on at the moment. Yeah, we know. We, we were told that he's he's very um, he's a big impact sub. So, you know, we knew that his strengths were coming off the bench and causing havoc, and he and he clearly done that. Um, but after the goal, I think we kept him pretty quiet, and then, you know, thankfully, I got to save that penalty. Uh, obviously, I asked this to Ollie. You're our highest rated player on EAFC uh, 24, but are you happy with your card? Um, yeah, kind of. I think the speed is a disrespect. 27 speed's a shocker. <laughs> but um, I'd like to, I'd like to a couple more, a few more points maybe. But it is what it is. 66. I'll, I'll take the highest. What stats are you upgrading then? I'm uh, kicking, speed, in fact everything. <laughs> <laughs> but I just give, I, I'd like I'd like to have stayed be around about 70, but we'll take 66. We'll Cheers, see what Connor. happens next year. Cheers, mate. All right, bud. Oh, that was clean.
Right, I'm joined by Ben Garrity outside the Abbey Stadium. 1-1 one, one draw, so many positives to take from that game, surely? Yeah, compared to Tuesday, um, there's a lot of positives. Okay, um, a few disappointment, but it's not a bad thing really. I think we just can't get too disappointed and get down. We always want to um, go and win every game, but it's a tough place to come. They're, they're playing well at home. I think the results all at home have been positive so far. So um, to come and take a point is good, especially at the end when Connor goes and saves the pen. 20th minute goal, that's your fourth in League One now and fifth or sixth in all competitions. How much of that do you owe to Andy Crosby to success so far this season? Yeah, he's put me on the pitch, um, getting in positions hopefully and taking me chances. So, you know, as, as long as he's put me on the pitch, I'm happy because there's a lot of competition here and, you know, I just need to keep um, performing and hopefully scoring goals. And I know a couple of weeks ago when I last spoke to you, you said that you were a bit frustrated or, you know, eager to start. And now you're slowly, yeah, working your way back into that starting eleven. So you must be delighted with yourself, the way you've worked hard to get back there. Yeah, I think any lad who's probably not playing is frustrated, aren't they? Um, but you can't really um, let it frustrate you too much because you've got to be ready for when um, you get the opportunity to go on a pitch. Right, and I've got your EAFC rating here. <laughs> I've said this to everyone else, 65 rated. I think you should be happy with that, to be fair. Yeah, I am. I wouldn't mind the shooting to be up a bit more, but I'll take that. Anything else other than the shooting that you think should be higher? All of it. <laughs> I think the pace might be a little bit um, on towards the uh, wrong. Wrong? It should yeah. be about 92. 92 yeah. pace? It should be the opposite way down. The 7 the other side, the 9 the other side, 97. What, and be uh, 56 rated? <laughs> <laughs> no, that'd be it. Uh... Cheers. Hold on, hold on, let's get the handshake. Cheers, Ben. Sorry, oh. Cheers,